Hey yo, what's up? Marjorie here, and well, it's been quite some time, but we are finally, finally back here on YouTube. It's been like, what, more than a month since I've been able to put up a YouTube video, but, you know, uh, life, life happens. But well, we are back here now, and what better way to come back than by checking out our beloved Triple S. And so today, we are going to be uh, checking out Triple S Visionary Vision with Hit The Floor. I've been super pumped for this one, and well... We just know it's gonna be great so let's just strap ourselves in and get right into it and let's see what visionary vision has in store for us with this one here we go <laughs> <laughs> what's that yawning in the back we'll see you later Ooh. oh this vibe The grills. I like that. This is so cool here. There's a lot of swag here. Oh. Okay, that was a bit abrupt. Wow. Okay. Whew. That was a trip and a half. <laughs> like, whew. I felt like like there's so much happening. Like, could barely focus on any particular thing. But first of all, the vibes are kind of giving me like, uh, rising. Especially the the aesthetic. Or um not not like not purely the aesthetic, but also like like the the 
the setting or the environment that they're in kind of reminds me of Rising. But they have some like particular callbacks to uh, previous songs. Like, I, of course, there was that part <laughs> they mentioned, "Invincible." Um, I, I'm not sure if I was seeing it correctly, but I think there was a part where they are doing a bit of the choreography for Generation, something like that. And some of the styles are crazy as well. Like, I really like the uh, Yu Yon with the pink hair. That was Yu Yon, right? And oh, the 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 black and white outfit of Kotone. That looked really really cool. But I gotta say, the member that really stood out to me the most in this one was Lin. And I really, really liked it. Like, Lin was so cool here in this MV. And it's just like... It's just so cool. <laughs> I can't find any other word to describe her. But we also see a lot of like these amazing shots from the other members uh, particularly uh, Soyeon um, there's a bit with uh, Shinri Kaede oh man like <laughs> this song just really really slaps in a lot of ways so yeah uh, let's watch that again shall we and Let's see if we can point out a little bit more, or let's see if we can notice a little bit more, because that first run through went by so fast, like, kind of had my head spinning for a bit. So, yeah. Let's head back there, click replay, here we go again. And yeah, who was yawning in the back? <laughs> is, is that Lin? <laughs> yeah, typical, like, uh, there's always that one member of the group when you're hanging out late at night. <laughs> and suddenly we get into this. Ooh. Th this scene in particular really reminds me of Rising a lot. <laughs> then we start off with Lin being dragged like this. And then for some reason, this scene as well, like, also kind of gave me rising vibes. But just because it's like a, this walkway outside of, like, an, uh, on the side of an apartment building, I guess. It's, it's mostly the setting. Wait, who is this though? Is that Kaede? I'm not quite sure. I'm <laughs> Please correct me if I'm wrong, but I, I do think that's Kaede. <laughs> but only with the grills here. Oh, wait. I just noticed the subtitle there. Soul L Woods. Oh. But yeah, Yu Yeon looks amazing here. With the pink hair, I really like that on her. And the glasses frame. Wow, it it <laughs> you can hardly recognize her, but uh, she looks like this sort of like otherworldly character. <laughs> Okay, this part here, for some reason, I really like it. Um, when uh, Yonji comes in, it feels really refreshing. It's just a second, but yeah. I really like that. Yeah. 
Also this. I really like this part. Okay, sorry, I wanna repeat that whole sequence, like, Kaede has this, like, this very u interesting juxtaposition to her that she just brings out this level of, like, youthful joy and cuteness, but at the same time, when she is dancing, there is so much swag there. It's just amazing. And yeah, I think I like this because I'm really partial to chanty stuff. There we go, Kaede. Take the center. Okay, yeah, this is the black and white outfit that I mentioned for Kotone. I, I don't know, she just looks very dangerous in this. I, I can't figure out a better word. <laughs> really. Yeah, I think I think that was Kaede, right? Because like we're getting a shot of all six here, right? So we have Yonji here in Ah no no no. Yonji here in Kaede. Lin Dion Kotone. Oh, Is that Nian? I don't know anymore. It might be Nian actually. It doesn't seem like Kaide anymore. Uh, uh, Kaide to me anymore. And especially since Kaide is right beside. <laughs> that might be Nian. Yeah, that was from Generation, right? That move. Yeah, this part feels like this feels like your flow. Nice effect there. I usually don't like drawing comparisons between groups, but like that part at the end there. Well, it's not really a comparison. It's more like like it it feels familiar. So that part at the end there, especially with with the cars flying swirling around them. It feels like the the latter part of 
Why Not by Luna. <laughs> and actually, a lot of the aesthetic also reminds me of that. Like, do we know who directed the MV for this? I, I don't know, I don't know. I, I can't see any... Uh, I didn't notice any credits or anything. But like, now that I'm thinking of it, it does remind me a bit of Luna's Why Not MV. Just MV-wise. Like with the aesthetics, uh, the, the fashion, the cars, even the swirling around thing. Although it's like, it's more like the lights swirling around Kim Lip became like the cars that were around Eve Tender. Sorry if I'm making too many Luna references, but like, should be fine. They're like, half of them are in the, almost half of them are in the same company, right? <clears throat> But yeah, uh, it just suddenly gave me those vibes. But the song, the song in particular, very different, very, very bouncy actually. And we get this like, 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 like it feels like it's. Some of the direction is going into this like hard hip hop thing, but overall the the song is just like very joyous to me. Is this something that that really pumps you up and just like it's not as gritty as I thought it would be. <laughs> But I, I actually like it that way. I, I I tend to not gravitate towards songs that uh, are too heavy. I usually prefer the more uh, joyful direction <laughs> when it comes to music that I listen to. Not always, but like... This one's pretty, pretty, uh, uh, pretty good at uh, lifting your spirits up. So yeah, uh, I'm really, really loving the energy of uh, Visionary Vision, and this was uh, this was a really, really nice mix of uh, the members of Triple S. So basically we had we have 12 members in this one, right? And then I think pretty soon we're going to get Hachi, right? So we'll be staying tuned for that as well. But in the meantime, yeah, we're here to enjoy like uh the music of well, the subunit Visionary Vision and so nice to see like uh them coming together to be able to uh, bring this kind of performance after <laughs> after all the bonding they did because <laughs> uh, we did watch the uh, the visionary v vision summer vacation series so yeah <laughs> uh, that was a, like a really really good bonding experience for them and I feel like it really up their uh, their chemistry as a group as a subunit so yeah uh, really really great track from visionary vision and definitely gonna go on to my daily playlist yeah so I think that is it for my reaction to hit the floor by triple s visionary vision and yeah, we'll be staying tuned for more Triple uh, S content in the future. So, 
don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, feel free to check out my Patreon, where I also post reactions to longer form content for casual content, most of which is available for free. You can probably see the titles pop up here on the side. There's also some bonus perks set aside for those who are kind enough to subscribe, such as access to my K-drama and anime reactions, which, incidentally, you can also access for free for 7 days, as that is tier 1 of my Patreon and it has a 7 day free trial, so you might want to, well, try that out. Also, higher tiers of my Patreon get various levels of early access depending on the tier, as well as priority when it comes to recommendations. But don't get too fussed about all that, like I said, most of the stuff on my Patreon is available for free, so don't be afraid to check it out, the link to my Patreon is in the description down below as well as a link to a spreadsheet where you can more easily navigate and access the said free content on my patreon so you might want to start with that first the link to that is also in the description down below anyways thank you so much for watching thank you so much for joining me on this amazing and epic journey with triple s visionary vision until next time have a great day everyone and hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye for now.